I don't drive. I've got nobody to take me, so I rely on my bus pass. Without the local bus service, my life would be a different matter. This bus is a lifeline to various people along this valley. I'm aboard the Wensleydale Flyer, a bus service that provides a vital link here in the Yorkshire Dales, but its future was very much under threat due to funding. Now, some of these people here joined a campaign to save the flyer. Now, thanks to Acorn Stairlifts, who joined with them, it can be saved for another year. The flyer operates on Sundays and bank holidays on a 40-mile route between North Allerton and the village of Gale, close to Hawes. 75% of its users are local residents, many of them elderly, who say they rely on the service as a local lifeline. It means everything, because otherwise I wouldn't get anywhere. I'm staying at home, and it's no good. I mean, I'm 77, so... It's no good staying in, is it? But we come up nearly every Sunday. It's a ride out, and we go for lunch. We have a walk around, and uh, it's it's ideal because if this bus wasn't here, we'd be stuck at Beedale. Like this lady, I'm on my own. And at weekend, on Sunday particularly, it's a day when right. you can right. be you can be very isolated, living on your own. And this bus is a lifeline to various people along this valley and I've always supported it. And supporters also come from the person credited with helping to make the Dales world famous by bringing the Tour de France to Yorkshire. Sir Gary Verity invited me to his cottage in Coverdale, close to the route of the flyer, to talk about the importance of transport networks across the Dales. You know, rural economies, and particularly upland rural economies like the Yorkshire Dales, are pretty fragile economically. The whole thing is held, held together and it wouldn't take much for something to start to unravel it. So pubs are really important. Um, local businesses and shops are really important. Uh, local provenance in terms of food and drink and clearly transport is really important. The Wensdale Flyer is the kind of thread that pulls the whole thing together and enables people who haven't got access to a motor car or choose not to have access to a motor car to move around the Dales. The flyer is managed by a subsidiary of the charity, the Yorkshire Dales Society, which raises money from businesses, public bodies and charitable donations to keep the buses running. The threatened loss of the flyer prompted a huge local campaign and a crowdfunding website was set up which raised enough finance to keep the bus running but only until Easter 2017. So the sponsorship from Acorn Stairlifts has paid for the service this year and the campaign funds can be saved to maintain it for a few months at the start of 2018. The problem we, we saw was the removal of, of this Wensleydale flyer service would have left a lot of people isolated and perhaps stranded. And the whole company ethos is that's what we try and avoid. We want to help people get from A to B on a daily basis and whether it's helping them get up and down their staircase, which is our primary objective, but, you know, the, the parallels ring true. You know, these people need to get to, from A to B, and without this service, they couldn't. Acorn Stairlifts produces more than 60,000 stairlifts each year at its factories situated between Bradford and the Dales National Park border, and it's won numerous awards for manufacturing and exports in recent years. When one of their employees heard about the threat to the flyer's future, the company decided to help. Well, although Acorn Stairlifts is the world's largest manufacturer of stairlifts, you know, it's a, it's a global company. But we have to remember where we came from, the Yorkshire heritage. You know, we still want to retain that local presence. And in order to do that, we, we have the desire, have always had the desire and continue to have the desire to put something back into the community and assist communities or individuals in wherever they need. The bus is also used by tourists and walkers who come to the Dales from all over the world. And one of the people who campaigned to save the flyer was the author and rambler who helped set up the original Dales Way walking route back in the 1960s. Without this bus, this whole Dale will be totally inaccessible for people without cars. Both the people who live in the area get the benefit, but also those of us who love the Dales, who want to come here and walk and enjoy it, we've got this wonderful bus service. And we hope we can find ways of keeping it beyond 2018 and make it a permanent part of the infrastructure of the Dales. 
and local walking groups also rely on the flyer. I caught up with members of one of those groups at the start of the bus route on North Allerton High Street. We've used it for several years really, it's only in recent years when the subsidy was stopped by North Yorkshire County Council that it became a problem and it's only then by sort of public donations and subsidies from other people or organisations that we've been able to keep it running. But we use it for uh, our main, mainly for our walking group which is North Allerton Striders and uh, also, we have family that live up the dale as well. You do find that a number of older people will take this particular bus up to Hawes uh, for a means of getting out into the countryside again, maybe going out for Sunday lunch uh, and coming back again. So uh, I think it's a definitely an essential service from all points of view. It helps us with our walks, gets people out. But also, I know a couple of people that use the bus to go and visit family because they can't drive now. So without the bus, they wouldn't see their grandchildren or their own children. Um, and that is important to keep older people from getting isolated. Well, my journey is almost over. We're on our way back to the depot. Most of the passengers have gone on their way and it's been fantastic to see how the intervention by Acorn Stairlifts has really helped all members of the community who use this bus service. This is Nick Wood aboard the Wensleydale Flyer saying bye for now. But without Acorn Stairlift stepping in, the Wensleydale Flyer probably wouldn't be keeping going long term. And so all of us in this part of the world and all visitors to this part of the world owe Acorn a debt of gratitude. They saw an opportunity to do something for the greater good, to put something back and to satisfy part of their corporate social responsibility. We should applaud them. Acorn, I mean, that was brilliant when we heard that. That was brilliant. So it's wonderful that a company has stepped in and said we'll sponsor it for a year, so, so we're very pleased. Well done. Well, yes, thank you Acorn very much. God bless you for keeping this service going this year uh, and hopefully uh, we can uh, uh, lean on you a little, uh, probably along with someone else, to sponsor it for another year. I'll put a word in for you, Pauline. You never know, we yeah. might manage to persuade them. I'm sure after they've heard you, they can't refuse, can they? <laughs> Lovely. <laughs>